story. Our story. Our story. story. At the beginning of 2009, um, kind of everything that I had going on in my life was all taken away in the first six weeks of the year. And we went to a house with four other guys, um, and it was a lot of fun hanging out. Always had people over, and around, well, actually on Valentine's Day. And Megan and I actually made dinner um, for some guys that she was friends with um, and brought it over to their house and that is when I first met James. They brought over dinner, which was a very good by the way, and um, I don't remember what we had. Um, didn't really think much of it. I didn't think anything of it at the time. In the middle of March, I moved to Keller um, and moved in with Megan and started um, getting involved with Milestone. Started seeing her more often at church just because she was hanging out. Didn't really have a job. In the middle of May, um, God just kind of worked everything out that I came on staff at Milestone and was working with the student ministry. And so. And jumped straight in, uh, being involved with the stuff we had that summer. And we went to um, junior high camp and we're both leaders. And that's really where um, I think both of us just started noticing each other a little more and just getting to do ministry together. A lot of fun. She was great with students and uh, I liked watching her do things she did with the girls and uh, I knew right then that I had a thing for her and uh, that thing was like... When I came back from that, um, I remember there was just a lot of praying about what that even means and what that looks like. I was an intern at the time in C3. Which really, being an intern, um, not really having time to pursue relationships and be in a relationship. So I try my best not to pursue her. I was kind of going back and forth, um, knowing that I was interested in him um, and loved getting to know him better, but wondering why the timing was like it was. We talked here and there, and of course we worked together every day. The spring started leading a connect group together, and just really loved all that time of getting to know each other better and seeing how we worked, seeing each other. Um, My internship was going to be over in May and I had had a few other conversations with my leaders um, and with Ashley. In March it was right around where we had our Battle of the Sexes retreat and I had really felt like God had really said that I was going to marry James, that James was going to be my husband. And a week before, um, in prayer, to prepare for battle sexes and other things, I really felt like God was telling me that Ashley was to be my wife. I wasn't really sure what to do with all of that, but was able to talk to Betsy about it and just continue to pray about it and just kind of... To meet with Pastor Tyron and I told him that I really felt like God was telling me that Ashley was to be my wife. And uh, he goes, well, I don't doubt it. And uh, he goes, Ashley's been telling Betsy the same thing. So around this whole time, and. Ashley didn't know that I knew, but I knew that she knew, and uh, that was kind of funny. James was about to go and raise support for this next year, and it was kind of the end of his internship, and so right before he went to do that for the month of May, um, we both sat down at different times with Pastor Tyron to get to talk to him about our relationship, and just feel like that was like something we were going to start when he was done raising support. He goes, well, when you get done with support, then y'all can start dating. I said, well, great. Then I'm just, the night I get done, I'm taking her out. And so May um, was kind of a funny month knowing that we were going to start our relationship, but it wasn't started yet. But this was a great time to get to pray over it and really prepare for that and um, get excited about what God was doing. I finished a, a little early from support. I wonder how I finished so early. And um, that Friday night after support was over, took her out, our first date. Started our relationship and it was just fun. It was different than anything I'd ever experienced before and um, just getting to spend time together and being so comfortable with one another. So now we're engaged and we're getting married May 22nd, 2011. We are now engaged and we're so excited um, about this next season and just what God has in store for us. <laughs>